Now, a Kenyan teacher who gives classes against violent extremism <laughs> says he doesn't regret losing out on a $1 million world's best teacher prize. Ayub Mohamud lost the Vaki Foundation Prize on Monday to Palestinian Hanan al hurub Mohamud was nominated for his de-radicalization classes at a school identified as recruiting ground for Islamist militants in suburb of Kenya's capital, Nairobi. Our reporter Trix Ngado spoke to the teacher before the award where he expressed expressed gratitude for the nomination. Isili is arguably the home of Nairobi's biggest Somali community, largely associated with booming retail business and a colorful culture. Recently, however, this suburb has been on the receiving end of terror attacks and youth radicalization, issues that have tainted its image. And now, Isili may be set to become the home of an international award winner who is spearheading the fight against radicalization. Ayub Mohammed is a teacher at Isili High School. He has been shortlisted for the Global Teachers Prize. For the past five years, he has given classes against violent extremism. I try to change their mindset about this issue of uh, violent extremism. So this violent extremism is a global problem. So I try to engage these students so that they can be change agents and peace champions in the community and even within themselves. His efforts are not lost on his students who take much pride in their business and religious studies teacher. Not all teachers do what he does. As youth, we need someone who talks to us the same way he does. We are afraid to talk about this topic to our parents. We feel afraid. And we, if you talk to other people, they think that we are the terrorists because as youth, we are really, really kind of, some people look at us in a very different way. I'm very happy because of our teacher. He has been the best teacher ever. He has been teaching us a lot. Ayub's greatest desire now is to win the prize and empower his students with critical thinking skills and confidence so they can reject extremism. So in Kenya there are challenges of unemployment, poverty, uh, pollution, radicalization and violent extremism. Ayub was nominated by the Vaki Foundation and is one of the ten finalists. Trix Ngado, KTN News, Nairobi.